I love the songs that we had even this morning. A lot of the songs are for the children. And uh, I think today I just wanted us to remember one who really loved the children of our assembly. And uh, I don't know, you probably have all heard that Myla has gone home to be with the Lord. And uh, when I heard about it, a song came to my heart and that kind of gave me also what I just wanted to briefly share. And that I should read one scripture first and it's from John 10, verses 28 to 30. And it says, I give them eternal life and they shall never perish. They shall never perish. No one shall snatch them out of my hand. My Father who has given them to me is greater than all. No one can snatch, snatch them from my Father's hand. I and the Father are one. In the same way, he has called us to be one with him. We're together working for him. We do his work. Now, Milo was very weak towards the end, as we know him. She was very weak, but Mark was shared this morning a little bit, and I think Margie could share a lot about Myla, because Margie and a lot of the ladies of the assembly sat with Myla and spent time with her, to be there, to share with her. And in the finished version of a particular song, the words actually say that heaven already begins in earth. And during Myla's last days, there were moments that she glimpsed angels, and she said she was surrounded by angels. And we are all surrounded by angels. The Lord looks after us every walk of our day. We never have to walk alone. When you feel a moment of discouragement, when you feel a moment, and the way I used to be in my life, when I felt discouraged, I'd go the wrong way. I felt God didn't love me. I listened to the lie. But there's one singer who's been singing lately who has said that God's love took away all those lies when he, she realized that God's love, he will never stop loving us. So when you get a discouraging moment, you feel like going the wrong way. You feel like this is my only way of relief. Instead, turn to the Lord. There was one fellow by the name of William Cushing who was a, called to preach the gospel. And he started preaching the gospel and he was preaching to people I don't know anything too much about his preaching ministry. But this fellow laid on my heart, this song came to my heart, one of his songs, as I was uh, working yesterday. And it was about an hour after I heard my lad passed away. And I, the song's words came in Finnish, because it's also a Finnish song. And uh, what I was thinking, he was called to preach the gospel, and then his wife got really ill, and his wife passed away. And he, William, felt really crushed. And then not only that, he was had to hit with health things and he wasn't able to talk anymore. Something happened. He wasn't able to preach the gospel. And he felt, I can't do anything. I have good news for you. None of us can do anything, but we are called to do what the Lord will do. And indeed, he started praying. He said, Lord, I want to do for your glory and honor what you will give glory and honor and words of songs started coming to him. And we're going to be singing one of those songs. In fact, you can look it up already. It's song number 61 in your hymn books, and we'll share it shortly. But anyway, as he, as he started singing these songs, they brought him closer. But the good news is, what I was going to say is that, do you know what? In uh, Finnish and in many languages, at least in Finnish and English, Cushing or shall we say, the Lord is still ministering through his songs. My love, love ministering in song and worship, but it was all for the glory and honor of the Lord. It wasn't for her own glory. For you that know the Maya, she did for the glory and honor of the Lord. And there are many a person who, as a child, sang with my and they were blessed, and I see it even happening, even as she was spending some of her last days here. So I'm, we're just going to pause in prayer, and then after that, we'll sing that song. And it's uh, it's in the Finnish theme. Uh, if I have it here. Just one second, because that... Um, I downloaded the ones with words for you, Baker. Yeah, I, I have... Oh, actually, yeah. We don't have to play it, because she has it on. That's right. She has it on the over it. Yeah, that's right, too. Lord, we just thank you, Lord, that you prepare all things for us. Lord, you, it is your work, Lord. 
Lord, we thank you that we often don't know the roots of where songs came, where ministry came, Lord. But it is your work, Lord God, and you have prepared the way for us, Lord. And we thank you that we are one with you. We ask that your word would minister to us today. But even these songs, and as we remember those, we realize that no one will snatch us away from you. Thank you that you love us and you have chosen to do so. In Jesus' name, amen.